To Anna von Bötticher, the deep blue sea is an enchanted world where she feels absolutely free, even free from scuba tanks. She's one of the world's best free divers. What's unique about free diving is that you're completely on your own. It's a confrontation with nature and with yourself, maybe even in the ultimate sense, in the final consequence. Here she's in the Mediterranean off Cyprus, preparing for the World Free Diving Championships. Freedivers master a special breathing technique known as apnea, allowing them to dive on a single held breath. The body realizes, okay, you're underwater, you can't breathe, so you have to conserve oxygen if you're going to survive. First your pulse drops, your heart rate slows down, your metabolism slows radically and it uses less energy. Everything is geared towards saving oxygen and keeping you alive as long as possible. Before going underwater, Anna von Bötticher concentrates solely on storing as much oxygen as possible in her lungs. Some apnea technique athletes push themselves beyond their limits and risk physical harm. Free diving is an extreme sport and not to be taken lightly. Our greatest risk is losing consciousness. When you hold your breath, you can always lose consciousness. And then, if you're in the water, even just in the bathtub, and that happens, and nobody is there to pull you out, you drown. We always keep an eye on each other. In other words, the moment I'm in the water and holding my breath, a partner needs to be there who knows how to behave in an emergency. Von Bötticher was already an experienced diver when she took a course in freediving in 2007. Within just six months, she'd set three German records. The same year, she brought home bronze from the World Championships in Egypt. Back home in Berlin, she trains for her dives three or four times a week. Many free divers take up yoga and various meditation techniques. But Anna von Bötticher prefers CrossFit. It's a grueling full body training program that pushes her to her limits. I train a lot especially at reaching my maximum heart rate. It's really exhausting, but gets results quickly. I'm a free diver, so I've only got one breath. And I need muscle condition that can work without using a lot of oxygen. And I'm making very good progress with CrossFit. Her approach to life is to go off the beaten path. She briefly traded her neoprene diving suit for a laptop. In May 2019, Anna von Bötticher published her first book. It's an athlete's autobiography and much more. I'm actually the opposite of a free diver. I have one lung that's too small, I'm not a good swimmer, I've got so many things that should stop me. But I'm still quite good at it. I've been one of the world's best for over 10 years now. So this book is meant to encourage everyone to approach life with a daring spirit. Back to Cyprus. Now Anna von Bötticher has to concentrate. She has big plans for this year's World Freediving Championships in Nice, France. The best discipline for me is freediving with a monofin. I dived 81 meters deep with one in 2013. I'd like to try again and see if I can make it one more meter down. That would be really, really great. I like sport and take joy in it, but experiencing the underwater world is always a priority for me. Anna von Bötticher has found her calling in the depths of the sea.